Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy Mushroom Bring you guys another pro tips and tricks video guys If you don't know there was a brand new weapon added to the game and this is the grappler you guys everyone loves this weapon It's super aggressive a lot of the pros are using it in crazy ways And I'm going to show you guys the best tips and tricks on how you can look like ninja out there using the grappler and stuff like that So basically if you don't know what the weapon does is it shoots a little plunger You suction cup and you go all the way up to where the plunger was shot at but you do take fall damage for it So we're gonna show you guys a little bit of pro tips and tricks so you can't take fall damage and what you can actually do with this grappling now watching this video just from watching it one time you're already going to learn a whole bunch of pro strats and stuff like that so guys please enjoy the video please give the video a thumbs up if it helps out at all and remember practice makes perfect so go ahead and head over to playground try this with a few of your friends and just 1v1 both of you having the grappler and you're going to learn a few things about it yourself so starting off with the first tip and pro tip and tricks and stuff like that if you guys noticed this was a 1v1 against me and one of my friends radical uh, we were just playing around with it trying to see how it's good how it works and stuff like that now I took high ground on him I have high ground now basically what he's gonna do is he's gonna be at the bottom trying to destroy it so that way he can regain high ground on me but I instantly heard him shooting so I decided to use this and then use the grappler if I use the bounce pad and then grapple I will never take fall damage at all just because the bounce pad will still have the effect where I don't take fall damage if you guys don't know you can use that bounce pad at whatever height and no matter what you won't take fall damage so it still happens even if you have the grappler and you use it right after so as you can see he bailed on me he ended up going to another building trying to run away from me because i think he was weak but instead i decided to remain aggressive use this use the grappler to get even more aggressive with him and just eliminate him just like that so guys using the grappler to be aggressive is a very good another good pro tip with it is to evade storms if you're trying to run away from the storm or if you're trying to get somewhere as quick as possible the grappler look at how quick this gets you across the map dude i mean literally it took like what three or four shots and look at how far back the other person is so if you're running away from the storm or trying to get into the next circle this is probably one of the best tips to use because it's very fast we even compared it to a cart an atk and still even with me messing up with the grapples i was still able to beat the atk so it just shows how quick you can actually get around the map with the grappler there are many different uses for this item another good one is to regain high ground as you can see he had high ground right there he was shooting down at me if i even tried to build up to him he was instantly going to shoot me down so what i did was i just used the grappler pulled out either a sniper or a shotgun got very aggressive and shot him right away so you have to remain really aggressive when you're using this weapon you can't really be hiding and stuff like that so with that being said remaining aggressive if you hear people shooting you can actually third party extremely quick as you can see i'm able to to get to this person as quick as possible i'm over here in seconds literally seconds so i'm able to third party and just kill them and try to end up killing the other people as well there's other ways of transportation i saw this on twitter where you use the rocket ride and you literally just grapple it and rocket ride yourself all the way across the map or wherever you need to go so basically you can be very uh creative with this weapon it just depends on how you want to get from point a to point b another good way to use the grappler hook another pro tip is to make sure that whenever you're taking fall damage or we're about to take fall damage if someone shoots your structure down look around there could be trees buildings or anything else that you can actually end up grappling to building to save yourself so that way you don't take any fall damage as you see i use the clock tower and right here i'm going to use the tree to help save myself so i don't take any fall damage and that's another good pro tip that a lot of people don't look at so the grappler can be used in many different ways like i was showing you guys in this video but another good thing is somebody has an rpg because it's very hard to get out of somebody just spamming an rpg before back then all you could do is just build 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 until they got close enough or they ran out of rockets or something like that but now you can actually remain super aggressive when they have the rpg just grapple closer to them, closer to them and you're gonna dodge every single rpg shot that they shoot at you and they're not gonna know what to do because you get over to them as quick as possible guys there you guys have the best pro tips with the grappler if i come up with any new pro tips i will go ahead and make another video for you guys talking about this if you guys please can give this video a thumbs up if you want more tips and tricks on the channel but guys thank you so much for all the love all the support if you guys please can give this video a thumbs up comment down below any pro tips that you have with the grappler and i'll see you guys in the next video peace